This is a, a film that was written by a woman, directed by a woman. It has many, many women in the cast. Can you uh, talk about what it's like to participate in evolving women in Hollywood? You know, it's been a very central question. Um, we went to Sundance with Before I Fall, and now I'm here at the Junket. Um, and it's been, a, it's been a question that's been brought up so frequently, uh, how, what a rarity it is to have um, so many women making a film. Mm -hmm. And to be completely honest with you, while I was shooting, I wasn't really aware. I was just working with really wonderful artists and filmmakers, um, and it's kind of, interesting that it's <laughs> such a it, it is such a point of discussion and as it should be we should bring um shine a light on that uh, but they're all such amazing people and um it's great to work with them mm -hmm. the film deals with both negative and positive aspects of female relationships right um can you talk about how you see your relationships with other women now well, I mean, I, I have always, I've been lucky to be raised by these like strong, powerful, working, empowering women. And I've always been surrounded by women who love women. And mm -hmm. I'm a woman who loves women. I, I, I feel, I'm not, I, I, and I'm lucky I don't have people that are weird and competitive. Like that's not, I don't have those relationships really. Um, so in terms of, uh, and, and in terms of Sam, I mean, the, the beginning of the film, she's a bully towards other, other f girls that is her school. And throughout the course of the film, she, you realize she's also bullied. You sort of, that, it, there's a light that's shined on the fact that she's not a hero or a villain. She's, there's that, a little bit more of a blurred line there. And by the end of the film, she becomes her own leader and she takes responsibility for her actions and learns that how she treats people has an effect on them, mm -hmm. you know? And that she matters. That, 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 that what you do today and in this moment matters, actually. And, um, and she learns to see the good in people. I love this. There's a scene where Sam Kingston is talking to her group of friends that are sort of this, they're not mean girls, but they, um, they don't treat people entirely with the utmost respect. Um, and she, she just tells them what's good about them. Mm -hmm. she reminds them that their flaws don't define them and loves them for who they really are. Mm -hmm which I, I think is beautiful. Mm -hmm. What do you hope that young women especially get out of seeing a film like this? That you have a voice mm -hmm. and that you matter mm -hmm. and that what you do can change the course of things. That's beautiful. I, I, I'm raising a young daughter, so. Oh, you are? How old is she? <laughs> She's nine and a half, and let me tell you, it's already started. <laughs> yeah. No, of course. Well, that, to me, it, is she in L.A.? Yeah. Well, to me, uh, people keep asking about my high school experience, and I, my high school experience was really wonderful. Um, it was a middle school experience that so was mm. really horrible and torturous, and literally yeah. I had to leave the school I was at because I was bullied so much. Mm -hmm. So for people that are... In LA, for your daughter, I totally get it. Ten is actually where it starts. Nine and yep. a half, ten is where it mm -hmm. starts. Um, and I feel for her. It's really horrible. Yeah, she's got a good head, though. So. Yeah, and a I, good mom. Thank you. <laughs>